my paper id s r 21115161248 my e presentation topic is growth of burmese nationalism under young men buddhist association my name is anindita choudhury i am research scholar of vishwavarati university introduction the earliest political movement on the british model was the young men's buddhist association popularly known as the ymba it was a native version of the ymca young men christian association founded in 1906 by rangoon college students mong ba khol pe mong mong gi mong la pe mong se la ong mong ba dun and their friends it should not be mistaken for a modern religious institution that grew into a political organization there were buddhist associations then in burma distinctly with modern concepts founded by the laity for the preservation and service of the sasana the buddhist spiritual realm they were the mission associations founded in mandaloy on 6 july 1897 which set up a school in its name the buddha kalana mitta athin friendship of mai in gyan was also founded about the same time which later moved to mandaloy and was absorbed into the former the sasandara athin service of mol main founded in 1899 which set up the sin bodha gosa school the ashoka society of basian founded in 1902 by an english convert to buddhism and the rangoon college buddhist association in 1904 besides a ymba was founded in arakan in 1902 complete with student hostel following the ymca model from about 1905 the lady do organized obhidhamma tankat association society and tathana hit athens in almost all towns keywords burmese nationalism young men christian association young men buddhist association buddhist religion political organization the earliest political movement on the british model was the young men's buddhist association popularly known as the ymba it was a native version of the ymca founded in 1906 by rangoon college students mong ba khol pe mong mong gi mong la pe and others it should not be mistaken for a modern religious institution that grew into a political organization there were buddhist association then in burma distinctly with modern concepts founded by the laity for the preservation and service of the sasana the buddhist spiritual realm they were the mission association founded in mandaloy on 6 july 1897 which set up a school in its name the buddha kalana mitta athin friendship of main gyan was also founded about the same time which later moved to mandaloy and was absorbed into the former the sasandara athin 
Service of Mall Main, founded in 1899, we set up the Sin Bodhagosa School, the Asaka Society of Besin, founded in 1902 by an English convert to Buddhism and the Rangoon College Buddhist Association in 1904. Besides, a YMBA was founded in Arakan in 1902, complete with student hostel following the YMCA model. From about 1905, the Lady the organized Abhi Dhamma Tan Khat Association, foreign mission societies and Tathana Heat Athens in almost all towns. The idea of organizing the YMBA according to U Bapo was thought up by him as he and his friends Mong Monggi and Mong Lape were talking a taking a morning walk along Dalosi Street, Rangoon. They passed by the YMCA building at the corner of Judah Iskit Street and thought they could set up a similar association through which political views could be disseminated. The idea was perceived because they were already preoccupied with the need for some way of preventing the arbitrary and excessive use of cursive means by the authorities. In those days, the British and Indian officials met the Burmese addressed them as Thakin, master, and when called to respond, Hapaya, lord. Furthermore, Burmese had to take off their footwear, fall to the ground and assume a respectful posture used generally for the worship of God, King or Shankha. When addressing or being spoken to by the officers, people not wearing European shocks and shoes also had to take off their footwear when entering classroom for studies. Thus, the Rangoon YMBA came into being in Rangoon College. It numbered about 26 close friends as active members for the first two years. They first made Mong Mong Gi's home the clubhouse and met weekly. Mong Mong Gi went to Calcutta to study for the MA degree. Mong Ba Yin for medicine and Mong Ba Pe, who was not rich enough to go abroad, remained at home and kept the association going with his house at the clubhouse. The association aimed to promote Amaya Bharta Tathana and Pioneer Race or Nation Language Sasana Buddhist Spiritual Realm and Education. I met regularly, it met regularly every week when one of its members delivered a lecture or organized a debate. Many of these gentlemen were members of the governor's council or senior government officials. They indeed were the new aristocracy of British Burma. Later after the monumental reforms of 1909, their rank were to swell even more. It was clear that with the entry of the young barristers, the loyalty elements had decided to take over control of the association, which they or the government could not legally stamp out. Most of the newcomers, both young and old, were extremely sensitive about their relation with British officials. Indeed, the British authorities became very apprehensive through the government 
servants might join the YMBA. Almost all Burman officers in government service, Burman brokers and traders, retired officials, teachers, Burman clerks, whether of business, forms or government offices, joined it by 1910 when the leaders decided to hold the first all Burma meeting of the YMBA in Rangoon on 20th March. They were about 22 associations. In this first conference, it was decided to form a general council as soon as possible to direct and administer the YMBA associations all over Burma. The speeches of it leaders, the deliberations, the resolutions at monthly meeting and the annual All Burma Conference until the third conference in 1915 all exhibited a deep concern to express repeatedly loyalty to the British Crown. It also recognized the need to appreciate and thank that the British administration of Burma for its blessings. Even to the extent of servility in order to assure that YMBA was not marked as a seditious organization. The government rejected this and aroused the resentment among YMBA members and the public. At the third conference, the YMBA became a little bolder and decided to send memorials to Asin Se in his worship the sovereign governor. They also claimed to appoint the minister for Buddhist Savana to appoint Dhamma Katikan lectures who would go around teaching Buddhism in schools and to grant the power of writing wills to Buddhists to prevent the sale of liquor to Burmese and encouraging Burmese salt making, enforcing compulsory education and holding primary school mathematics examinations for poor children etc. During 1908, the YMBA also produced in English its official organ, the Burma Buddhist Weekly. They were then in Burma a couple of English dailies and the few weeklies and their subsidiary weekly Burmese news bulletins, which were translations of certain parts of the English paper. All of them were pro officials and therefore on 4th July 1911, Mong Bape and his friends Mong Lapo decided to produce a vernacular newspaper of nationalist orientation. Conclusion Though it was not the official organ of YMBA, later it adopted the policy of political. YMBA made step-by-step -step demands for the appointment of Burmese, but British never gave them. There was no serious conflict within the YMBA, but in the early 20th century, Burmese nationalism divided in two ways under Young Men Buddhist Association YMBA organization. One was moderate and the other was extreme. YMBA was the first organization in Burma which helped to fight for the cause of freedom of the nation. This helped to grow the sentiment of nationalism in Burmese people. In this way, the nationalist movement reached their goal by getting the independence in 1948.